Here comes the field for tonight's featured 11th race pace. Tompkin Gear Stakes, three-year-old Colton Gelding Pace, $39,000. Exact and trifecta wagering one bundle of money. Owned by Sarah Cup, driven by Roger Culifer. Number two is Keystone Exclusive, owned by Max and George Hemp, along with the driver, Roger Hammer. Three, Let's Rock, owned by Ralph Conley Jr. and Brad Henners. Number four is Gifted Cowboy, owned by Diana Ackley and Norma Huber, driven by Mike Wilder. Five is Ace Sabra, owned by Jack Shear and Ronald Postley, driven by Chip Noble. Six is Jates Touch, owned by the Endless Summer Stable, Cliff Siegel, driven by Jeff Fout. Seven is Bunny Battle, owned by Dan Russo and Robert Parker with Jody Yussing. Eight is Broad Grin, owned by Elbridge Moxley. Janet Moxley, Dave Hawk will be in the sulky. Field for the 11th, $39,000 three-year-old Colton Gelding Pace. Post time in five minutes. Starting gate is underway, and here comes the field of eight for $39,000. One bundle of money in Roger Culifer. Two Keystone exclusive driven by Roger Hammer. Three Let's Rock and Brad Hanners. Four Gifted Cowboy Mike Wilder will be aboard. Five Ace Sabra and Chip Noble. Six Jates Touch, Jeff Fout. Seven Money Battle, Jody Essig. And number eight, Broad Grin and Dave Hawk. Feel for race 11 is at the gate and moving through the clubhouse turn. Horses and drivers are now in the hands of the starter, John Betts. It is post time. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and pacing. Jade's touch on the far outside. Let's rock between horses. Bundle of money along the rail. They're down the back stretch. Keystone exclusive being taken back a bit to fourth. Gifted Cowboy settles in there fifth, followed by Ace Sabra in sixth. Money Battle in seventh. Broad Grin trails the field. Let's Rock got out left. He's in big trouble by the opening quarter. Jates Touch is there. Unreal 26 and two. Speeding past the stands to the half mile pole. Jates Touch on top by a half a length. Let's Rock swings up on the outside. Brad Hanners rocks him into the lead, but Kenny Clear trying to take back along the rail. Jates Touch second. Roger Culifer is now biding his time with Bundle of Money third. The Hammers got Keystone exclusive up close to fourth. Around the lower turn, Gifted Cowboy A Sabra. Money Battle has got to be enjoying this journey in broad grin. 55 flat. Flying down the back stretch. Let's Rock is called it a night. Jates Touch leads by two. Bundle of Money picks up the chase second. A Sabra Overland. Money Battle kicks in with the most pace on the far outside. Little more than a quarter of a mile to drive. The four to five favorite will be tested all the way home. Jates Touch, bundle of money is at his wheel, disc in second. Ace Sabra third, money battle is up on the outside. Along the extreme outside, Broad Grin and one twenty-three and two. After Burners are on as they move to the head of the stretch. Jates Touch digs down deep. Moving up on the outside, bundle of money. Off the turn, in the stretch, they're on their way home. Jeff Fout brings out the whip. It's Jade's touch. Bundle of money on the outside is closing with every stride. Gifted Cowboy, the late closer. Two wide here, and Jade's touch goes wire to wire. Six Jade's touch goes coast to coast. One bundle of money, a very game second. Finishing third in here, number four, Gifted Cowboy, and eight, Broad Grin, was fourth. I'd like to thank our sponsor of Grand Circuit Week, one of them tonight, Budget Car and Truck Rental. Representing Budget Car and Truck Rental in the winner's circle, Julie Herrera and Chrissy Vizalden. Big welcome to those folks from Budget Car and Truck Rental, Julie Herrera and Chrissy Vizalden. Result of tonight's 11th race, now official, 6-1 exact at $10.80. The try, 133.40. Windows are open on the 12th. Exact and try effect of wagering. Claiming handicap for high price ones, 20 to 30,000. Post time in 12 minutes at 10.48. Here comes Jate's Touch. Three-year-old brown gelding by Jate Lobel out of Touch of Silk. Owned by the Endless Summer Stable of Utica, New York. Clifford Siegel of Brooklyn, New York. Trained by Mark Capone. Wire to wire driver, Jeff Fout, 152-3. Six, Jates Touch, the winner.
Top down, bundle of money second, Keystone exclusive eighth, Let's Rock seventh, Gifted Cowboy third, Ace Sabra sixth, Jates touched the winner, Money Battle fifth, Broad Grin was fourth. Two eight seven, three six one, five and four, the mile was one fifty two and three.